microcontrollers or MCUs are at the heart of every electronic device. They are compact integrated circuits designed to govern a specific operation in an embedded system. An MCU is a small computer on a single integrated circuit. It includes a processor, the brain, memory for storing data and instructions. With input and output peripherals, unlike general purpose computers, MCUs are designed for specific control oriented tasks. So what are some of the key components in MCUs? You have the central processing unit. CPU executes instructions stored in memory. It performs algorithmic and logic operations and controls the flow of data within the MCU. Memory. MCUs typically have two types of memory, read-only memory or ROM that stores the firmware and permanent programming of the MCU, and random access memory or RAM that's used for temporary data storage during operation. Now you also have the input and output peripherals. These allow the MCU to interact with external devices. Now you also have timers and counters which are essential for managing time-based tasks and generating precise time delays. There are also analog to digital converters. These convert analog signals like sensor data into digital forms for the MCU to process. You could also have digital to analog converters. These convert digital signals back to analog. So how do MCUs work? When you power on a device that has an MCU, it starts executing a predefined program stored in memory. This program predicts how the MCU should respond to various inputs and controls the output accordingly. For instance, in a thermostat, the MCU reads temperature from a sensor and adjusts the heating and cooling systems to maintain the desired temperature. Whether you're interested in home automation, IoT, or robotics, mastering MCUs is a fundamental skill for electrical engineering. For more on engineering, make sure to like and follow eDesignit, and remember to visit eDesignit.com.